Some of the treatment options are those that are endovascular, which we can uh, perform, Dr. Lopez and I can perform, working from, you know, within the body's own spaces, working within the arteries. And this can oftentimes include using a balloon and or a stent to really open up that artery and uh, reestablish a more normal, uh, favorable lumen to that artery so that laminar flow can then continue. Um, these procedures are, are, are have their strengths and limitations, and I think it's really important that we really take the time to sit down with you and really consider your case in, in all of its detail, and, and as well as collaborate amongst ourselves to make sure we're really choosing the right option. And if this option is seems appropriate for you, the primary advantage is that it has been shown to be quite effective and hopefully minimally invasive at the same time. If you have any other questions about narrowing of the arteries in the neck or the brain, please feel free to contact either Dr. Lopez or myself. We look forward to helping you out.